The devil didn't accuse Job to God of particular sins like lust or investing money in useless things. He didn't accuse of such things. What is surprising is that the devil's accusation was to attack Job's motive for serving the Lord. Why do you serve the Lord? Why do we serve the Lord? If we do not clarify our reasons for serving the Lord, we may fall into the devil's accusation. Someone might be serving God, thinking that God might give some blessings, like our religious people who pray to Buddha for prosperity. Like give and take, someone might be serving God, hoping, "If I do this, God will bless me. If I do that, God will protect my family." What about you? What about us? Isn't it heavy to take in? The devil knows. He knows what to target. The devil exactly knows our weak points. Are they not really the weak points? Why am I here? Why did I become a Christian? Why am I serving God? Satan always accuses the righteous people. Revelation chapter twelve verse ten says, "For the accuser of our brethren, who accuse them before our God day and night, has been cast down." Here in Revelation chapter twelve verse ten, the devil is called the accuser. When does the devil accuse us? Day and night. Even if the devil once accused and lost, he doesn't just give up and goes to someone else. The devil never gives up, but keeps accusing us to undermine our faith, making us doubt God and His faithfulness and justice. Day and night, never giving up. Luke chapter twenty-two verses thirty-one and thirty-two is the word of the Lord to Peter, Simon, Simon. Indeed, Satan has asked for you that he may sift you as wheat. But I have prayed for you that your faith should not fail. This is what Jesus said to Peter directly. But later, Peter denied the Lord three times, didn't he? Mercifully, in the end, Peter was martyred on the cross upside down. The devil continually tormented Peter to make him deny the Lord. It wasn't woman, it wasn't money, it wasn't fame that the devil hit Peter with. The devil's accusation that struck Peter was fear. You too are his disciple. I'm not. Your accent is Galilean. I do not know the man. Peter cursed and denied Jesus because of fear. What are my weaknesses? It could be lust. It could be money. It could be work. It could be pleasure. It could be studying. And it could be fame. The devil continues to ask, "Give to me. Give Peter to me." Give me this useless disciple. The devil accuses, saying that Peter is not following Jesus out of love, but to sit on the right or left hand of Jesus. Does he follow you for nothing? Give him to me. The devil continues to accuse. He will continue to accuse us.